Um, going into the game, you know, I was real excited to play. It's been a long time, like you said. Um, and I think, you know, the most important thing for me going into it was, uh, you know, testing my body to see if I can last the entire game. And, and also the excitement of getting back in, you, the things you miss uh, from not playing after a year, you know, the, the, the knocks, the battles, the one-on-one -on -one stuff uh, during the game that, that, that I enjoy. And you really miss that stuff. You don't realize you miss it until you play. Um, and today afterwards, you know, I think uh, pretty sore, body was sore, but, um, you know, I'm real happy with the way I reacted and how my, how my body and my hip in particular reacted. So feel good now, ready to, to, to keep moving forward. Yeah, you know it has. Um, like you said, being familiar with the with the city, being familiar with the uh, <laughs> with the guys on the team that like to mess up interviews. Um, I think it's really helped. Um, finally, I'm settled into a little house, a little apartment. So um, now I can you know give all my attention to to getting fully healthy and fit. Um, I think rivalries, uh, the most important, the most enjoyable thing about them is the, the emotion that comes along with it. I think, um, you know, a lot of guys get a little bit more up for those games than other games. And um, it's kind of like a big test to see who, um, you know, who really has it on that day. And, and I think the emotions are usually a little bit higher and uh, that makes it more enjoyable. You know, absolutely. Um, I think that I wouldn't be a professional if I couldn't, you know, sit here and say that I'd be able to come in and play this weekend. And, um, you know, especially with how my, my body reacted last week after the Baltimore game, um, I definitely feel that I can uh, jump in if need be and play a solid and a good 90 minutes.